Gamer. Today we're going to be playing Black Ops 3, but we're not going to be playing Shadows of Evil. We're going to be playing Dur Reese. And you guys may be wondering why I got the Reese before the Giant. But because this is a pretty cool map, it has the pretty cool bow called Wrath of the Agent, Agents. And I actually am going to try to get the Lightning Bow. And that is kind of like the easiest one to upgrade, but it's like the best bow. So yeah, uh, we'll get into it. I'm going to be cutting parts in this video because I want to get everything into it. And it is Thanksgiving Day. So I hope you all have a great Thanksgiving. And let's get started. So yeah, I didn't get the I didn't get the giant, but I'm probably gonna get Shimanuma, Goldrod, Rovi, and Revelations. Revelations in my option is um um pretty much uh, my favorite. But their Reese it's like a tie because um they're both awesome. See this cutscene. wasn't how it was supposed to go. We were supposed to secure the package and be in and out clean. Instead, the whole thing's been one disaster after another. Eat my blade, beast! Ah, fucking move, maggot addicts! Today, you die! Oh. First, I took your legs! Now, I take oh. your life! I should never have trusted you, Richtofen. Never. Well, that's the cutscene. That's the cutscene, so we'll just say get right into it. So if you don't know what the the what do you call it? Well whatever this thing is. Uh you could call like little power ups from them. So they're good to have. And you wanna go through this door first. A lot of people might want to go through the door up there, I'll show you it. Uh, that's a power door, so you need to get power for that. And you might want to go through this door, but that door takes longer to get the power. And power is like your first priority inside any zombies map. So all you want to do is just get as much as points as possible. And get out of here quick. Try to do like almost like all your bullets and then a knife. That could get you a lot of points. Oops. Dang it, I knew it. The test subjects must be recovered. The damage caused by their past actions must not be allowed to repeat themselves. What's going on? It's just like all of a sudden outbreak is just everywhere. We go back in time, outbreak. When did this start? Alright. Next priority is either getting a gun or starting the bow. I recommend starting the bow because once you get this bow, it's like you can't be beaten. Like all like and to beat the panzer you just go up into the fire the little death ray trap. Picks it up 
Then you're good. Continue my mission. I require munitions. Oops, I totally missed. I will guide you to your sleep. So try to kill zombies around this thing. And avoid any nuke power-ups. The dark zombie. In this cursed place. Maybe impossible without ammo. So try to like farm the zombies around on lower rounds. Cause it's round two. And I'm getting a little bit of the dragon done. Mysterious spirits aid us in our quest. Ooh, a thousand. My solitude allows me to reflect on questions before us. What forces does Richtofen seek to harness? Has he really changed for the better? Can the universe be saved from itself? I am uncertain. I don't know what that means. You must have a Dizwish to dare touch Tokyo. Well, that's his name, Tokyo. I always call him Tango. Try to just like farm them around. Get them all clumped up. And then come around and just like get the kill. And try not to get a knife lunge in. Try to just like clean get like a far knife in like this. So then you can knife quicker. Oh, we're done. Hurry up, man. Hurry up. So next we need a lot more money. No. Hell calls for you. To dare to scratch Tokyo is to dare to invite death. Start the rituals in uh, Sounds of Evil. Try to avoid knife lunges in this kind of big group. Because they will all scratch you at the same time. And you will die. Yeah. Just kind of let them come to you. Is there a running one? Somewhere? I'm afraid there's going to be a running one behind me. Alright, alright. Back up. Alright, alright, alright. Almost forgot something. Makes my job a little easier. Once again, try to avoid knife punches. Because you can knife real quick. I think one or two more kills should be enough. Yeah, exactly enough. Too bad I'm using all my money on this over here. Hopefully that's not last zombie because I need more points for An any gun. Presence hangs in the rafters of this room. Cause dogs are gonna come. To the bones. Dogs will definitely come. And those are what most likely are gonna kill you. This electricity restored. We will encounter new opportunities. Cause I got killed by um dogs while playing solo. So it's either get quick revive or get a decent gun to kill dogs. Cause it's three hits. And they come by like round five, I believe. Now where's that zombie?
anti-gravity rooms in here. And I believe this is how you can get out of here too. Nope. Oh, and this is parts for pack a punch. So you want to get that. A fragment. A broken piece. All will be repaired. Spirits are restless here. Tortured by the work of our adversaries. All right. Yeah, just when I needed it. So it doesn't really eat it, but it does activate it. Just think of this as Mob of the Dead. If you ever seen it, Mob of the Dead, like, get all the dogs and then you get the retriever. Just like that. I need so much more of a gun. What? Feed it! I missed like all of those bullets. You are not fit to stand before me. Now I need a gun. Yeah, perfect. Now I just get to come back here and get the RK5. I am ready and willing to fight for all eternity. So you kind of want to spare zombies when you're doing this. So, you know, so you could just kind of like get the whole dragon filled up just in like one round. Cause it's round four. I do do stuff kind of fast, but I could do it still. All that matters is if we get it. Now where's the zombie? Speed. I will send them to the next life. Something a little cool animation to eat the darn zombies. So kind of like when you eat something, kind of like wait like one or two seconds because it has like a little animation. Dang it. So I like, kind of like walk up to it, get the kill. What I recommend for the RK5 is kind of like burst and then two knife it, sort of. Depends what round you're on. I know I will emerge victorious. This is kind of a slow process, but it does work. I'll cut to it when we're uh, past the dogs. All right, I'll see you guys then. All right, guys, this is gonna be the end of this part of the race, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Sorry I had to cut it like this, but my video was too long. So, see you guys later.